evening everyone uh this is a mega comrade officer Eranomigo Edegbe uh this is the open leader of uh, people's freedom movement uh I'm trying to do what I do every time you know so just give me one minute I'm gonna be with you so I want every brothers and sisters to go ahead and do what you do best you know what I mean so we got to do this together, you know. So it's all about the movement, you know. Uh, I want to greet everyone. Uh, I want you all to know that I love you. You know, I love every brothers and sister. So I'm about to be true, you know. It's going to be a good show today. Uh, we're going to talk about uh, EFCC. And uh, we're going to talk about the Nigerian police. We're going to talk about the corruption. Then I'm going to address some issue later on, you know. Uh, today, uh, I'm going to let everyone know, those are from Edo State, you all should be happy. The problem is about to get out of Edo State. So every brothers and sisters that come from Edo State, you all should be very proud of our movement. So we are together, you know. The South African, the corruption leader, they are not going to be able to, to push this problem to Edo State. So Edo State is not the origin of corruption. So, so therefore, the problem cannot lie in Edo State. So I want everyone to know. Uh, I need everyone to mind their business. No question should be asked about that until further notice. In a by more time, I will be able to be back, you know, to let every brothers and sister know what's up. You know what I'm saying? So it's all about the corruption. So we all got to fight together to make sure that we eradicate corruption completely. You know what I'm saying? So that is the deal right now. So go ahead and share my video. Go ahead and do it. You know, uh, we're going to be collaborating with Nigerian Police Department, the good police department. So, I mean, Nigerian Police Force. So that is uh, breaking news, number one. Uh, what is okay? So I am done with this. Almost true. Mm -hmm. So it's good to do. You know, you gotta lead by example. You know, I just share my video right now. Okay. This is the People's Freedom Movement shirt. You know, as you can see, you can see it right here. There is the logo right here. There, here is it. So. This is one of our shares. Like I promised, today is Friday. You can see it. Uh, then I'm going to go ahead and show you this. Uh, as we are doing this, I want to go ahead. I want you to go ahead and shout, you know. Go ahead. Take your time. Don't be selfish. Go ahead and share the video. Don't be selfish with it, you know. We got to know. let everyone know about it. You know what I'm saying? So it's all about the people, you know. So I love you all. I know you all are the best. Uh, I already did mine. So let me go and show you. So it's all about corruption today. You know, we're going to hit the corruption, people. Yeah, here is the... If you want to go ahead and place your order, you can go ahead. Here is it. This is the black one. You can see it. Yeah. So I believe you all can see it. So you can see the material right here. It's a really light material. This is one. Uh, here is the other one. This is the red color of it. You can see it. The same thing. Then these are the t-shirt. Here is the white one. This is made in USA. Made in United States. You know what I'm saying? So you see, this is not going to go away, you know. It's not like the one they do in Africa. Then you can just touch it, it go away. It's not going to go away. It's going to stay. You can see the logo right here, you know. This is, it was transferred to the computer, you know. This, you can see it. So all you just have to do, wash it, that's it. You know, this is the white one. You can see the under, you know what I'm saying. You can see the design. You, you can see its figure, you know. You see it. It's not like uh, just, you know, you can see it right now. So, here is another one. This is another quality of it. You know, this one right here, you know, is the normal t-shirt. You know, four figure, you know. So, you can see right here. 
So this one that I'm wearing, this is going to be for, this is like, this is more expensive. You know, this one I'm wearing, you can see it right here. It's not that expensive though. It's just $30, you know, it's just $5 more. Those are $25, you know. Place your order, call my line, come to WhatsApp, call my Facebook page. So the order for now is going to go directly from United States to everywhere, every part of the world. The order have to come from United States, you know. We got to send it to Europe, wherever it is. I mail it, you know. I mail it, then you get my address, you get People's Freedom Movement, P.O. Boss, everything authentic. There is no counterfeit on this. No counterfeit. If you get an order or anyone call you that, oh, I got People's Freedom Movement shirt, T-shirt, it's a lie. It's called counterfeit. So they're going to be prosecuted for it. You know me, whatever I do, I make sure I do it right. They're going to be prosecuted. I can fly to Europe because of that, you know. They'll pay the legal fees. They pay the expenses. They pay everything. If they have no document, they're going to be in problem. If they have document, not until they pay if they has a house, they can put a lien on his house. If he has an apartment or anything, his document will be in jeopardy. So that is one thing no one can do. Counterfeit. I hate counterfeit in my life. So, brothers and sisters, I'm a happy man. You see what I'm saying? So, I'm happy today. Glory be to God. The Lord is good. I uh, want every brothers and sisters to be proud of Nigeria. Nigerian citizens are not the problem of Nigeria. You know? We, the Nigerian, we are not the problem of Nigeria. The problem of Nigeria are the corrupt bad leaders. You know what I'm saying? Are the corrupt bad leaders. So we're gonna welcome every part of the world. Anyone, anyone, you know, it's a it's a it's a beautiful day. So we're gonna I got a let me make this breaking news announcement. I got a email from a Nigerian police department, and I got a, a message from Nigeria high rank AIG. I'm not gonna mention what zone it is from Nigeria. So what they did is for us to help them track down the corrupt criminals the corrupt leaders so when i got it i was shocked you know what i'm saying i said wow okay this is what i'm be fighting for if nigerian law enforcement they want us to work with them oh well glory be to god i want to do that you know what i'm saying i want to do that you know i want to do that so we are going to fight corruption together so i'm going to go straight to the point and uh I want everyone to understand awareness awareness impact is very crucial in anything you do in a life if you're gonna be successful you want to be the best of the best come on people freedom movement do me a favor go ahead just click on that button share invite click on it because what we're gonna talk about here is how we're gonna deal with corruption EFCC you know what I'm saying EFCC. So, let me go straight to the point. Awareness impact is the best thing you can do in life. So far, the People's Freedom Movement are able to do that. Now, we are now on psychological impact. The psychological impact is what we are doing. Then it's going to come to reality impact. I want everyone to understand this movement does not belong to Edo State. It does not belong to Nigeria. It belongs to the whole world. Everyone. Every brothers and sister. Anyone that have good heart. Who want to join to fight this fight. You can join. But we are not a political movement. We do not want executive. No. I want to address that. There is no executive in this movement. Executive have been abolished, void, no more executive. If you want to join us, you want to fight for freedom, fight to help restore Nigeria name, we can do it together. You know what I'm saying? So, that is what I'm saying. Uh, don't worry about what everybody do. There's still going to be a knucklehead. There's still going to be a knucklehead. What we call pinhead. No matter what you do, they can never be happy. They are out for destruction. I call them pinhead. You know what I mean? So they are knucklehead. 
So you don't need to worry about them. It don't matter if you do good. There are people in this world, no matter what you do, they're going to bash you. We're having a boyfriend. We're having a girlfriend. No matter what your girlfriend do, they keep hearing it. You are not good. You ain't need that. You are not that. You don't, nothing that we do that will satisfy this knucklehead. You know what I mean? Women, most especially. I'm happy I'm one of the good men out there. You know what I mean? You're free to say whatever you are. But for me, I know what I am. So, no matter what a woman will do to them, do for them, they will never be satisfied. These men, they are the same men that are corrupt. They are the one. No matter what you do for them, even if you give them a goat to eat, they will eat pepper soup and tire. Still, you can never satisfy them. They are demons. Satans. They are among us. That is the fact. You know what I'm saying? So, there are some women, no matter what a man will do for them, they will never be satisfied. They jump to a conclusion. You know what I'm saying? So, that is it. Everything that I'm doing here online, I'm doing it with the power of Almighty God. God is my power. So far, we are moving forward. We are making progress. As I understand, there's a lot of things going on in a dual state. So, it's about the police commissioner. Police commissioner. What, 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 what they call him? C.P. Guando Abuka. What he did in Olobo, if anyone is listening to me, Olobo, I am not from Olobo, Olobo, very close to Benin. A man went ahead, they called me from Olobo yesterday, crying, begging. These are not my family. This is what I do, and I love doing it. I love helping people. So when they called me, they told me that they, a man, a gentleman, went ahead, take someone to a land to root palm, palm tree. You know what they call palm tree? That palm tree, you can get a palm one from it. They root it. When they root it, a policeman came. However, they said the story. Now, let me call it short. Nigerian police force, Edo State Police Command, now they are demanding 200,000 naira for rooting or rooting palm one tree. You know that palm tree? Can you imagine that? 200,000 naira. And they want to charge this guy, individual, to court. They want to put him in jail. He's already in jail. They want to put him in prison. So, if a Doe State Police Commissioner cannot put a corrupt leader like this senator, you know what I mean? This useless leader in Abuja, these rubbish people, if they cannot arrest anyone, why are they arresting someone who caught a power tree? Palm tree. Come on, Nigeria. We got to wake up. You know what I'm saying? We got to wake up. A power tree. Now, I told him, I said, I cannot do anything. It's too late. You're going to call today. So, I went to, her, to his Facebook page. I find out he has not even shared one of my videos. That is why it's, it's, it's good for you to share. Either you like it or not, that's fine. If you don't share, when the rainy day comes, you're going to call on me. I'm going to go to your Facebook page. I'm going to make sure and see if you are sharing my page. If you are not sharing it, I'm not going to mind anything you are saying. I will do my best a little bit. I'm going to be gone. So I am calling on anyone in a do state, a do state government, to tell Commissioner Abuka Guandu to leave a do state for a do state people. Commissioner have come to create fight in between Edo people. But we are smarter than them. We are more brilliant than them. The political cartel leader, the cat and cheaters government of Nigeria, we the Edo people, we are smarter than them. You can never create fight in between two brothers and sisters and expect the fight to continue to go on forever as you want. Hell no, it's not going to happen. Not on my watch. I am a very smart man. I might not have a doctorate degree, but let me tell you, I have it in wisdom. Let me tell you, wisdom of God can never, can never, no one, no professor can train you or teach you or give it to you. No, it's not easy to come online, come online and speak your heart out. I don't want to be caged. I don't want to be told what to do. Do this, do that, do this, do that. No, enough for all talk, no action. If you want to do your thing, go online, do what I do. Let's join together. Come on. Let's grow together. Let's help Nigeria. So, I don't want all this talk, 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 talk. This is how I connect with my people. 
These are my people. This is who I love. You know what I'm saying? So if you have an advice for yourself, go ahead and advise yourself first. You know what I mean? So go ahead and advise yourself. Then you eradicate the enemies one by one. You remove them. You know what I'm saying? So that is it. A don't stay police commissioner. Useless commissioner. The most disgraced commissioner in Nigeria history. Gwando Abuka. Gwando whatever they call your name. I don't even want to know how to call your name. You need to get the hell out of Edo State. The battle. The justice that you are denying our youth. The criminal activity that you are doing in Benin City. It's time for you to leave. And leave Edo State for good. Go to Abuja Federal Capital Corruption Headquarters. Go there. Go and stay there. That is number one. Edo State Commissioner. I am telling every individual in Edo State, you need to go on the street peacefully. Listen to me. Peaceful protest. Go on the street peacefully. Go and tell the commissioner. Write a big... Just do it. Write a big Edo State Police Command. Commissioner, leave a door state for a door people. That is number one. Bam. Once you do that, nobody's going to arrest you. Trust me. Trust me. Nobody's going to arrest you. It's freedom of speech, freedom of assembly, freedom of expression, freedom of the press. All together, go with press. Go there. Do not go there and start stealing. Do not go there and start destroying property. Do not go there and start attacking vehicles. No, when you do that, you're going to go to jail. And when you go to jail, you call on me. I'm not going to ask on you. Don't say, I send you there. Iran amigo, do not send you there. I do not condone violent. Violent is not with, I don't like it. So that is number one. I want every brothers or sister, all people freedom movement, I want you to praise yourself. I love everyone. This movement, no one man, not even the other man, anybody, not even who they, what do I call it? Abuja? Abuja can't stop it. President Trump cannot stop it. The President of the United States cannot stop this movement. Look at my face. I am a tiger and a lion. I fight and I fight and fight until you take my last breath. When you see me, I do not fight on issues. You know I love those people. You know I want to be close to them. You know they are my brothers. You know they are my sister. Do not think, me keeping you quiet, that make me a weak man. Hell no. There's no tiger that is weak. There's no lion that is weak. I want you to know that. Let me tell you, Nigerian corrupt leader, you need to quit whatever you are doing. The uprising, peaceful uprising, is on its way. I am calling on Nigerian corrupt leader. Peaceful uprising is on its way. Enough of all this corruption. Enough of all this oppression. Enough of all this political uh, imprisonment. We do not want it. I don't give a damn about PDP. I don't give a damn about APC. I don't care if there's any Zimbra party or Pure Water party. If I'm going to run for any political party, I can register Pure Water. Pure Water alone. I can do it. That is it. And I will beat any opponent because I am an authentic comrade. And whenever I say something, I do it. You know what I mean? My father's name is Talk and Do. You can hear about it. So that is it. So let's go back to EFCC. Now, I want to let everyone know that we all have a common enemy. Every brothers and sister, we all have a common enemy. And that enemy is corruption, number one. Corruption virus, number two, is death. It don't matter if you are APC, you are PDP, you are whatever, you are afraid of death, number one. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? If you are not in power, you have no way to feed your family. You have not, no way, not, no way. No, I mean, you are in hunger. You know, we are in abroad. We send money home. Everybody send money home. No matter how much money you send home, it's not going to be enough. You know what I mean? So, we want everyone to understand. We all have common enemy. Death and corruption virus. So, if you are here fighting me, you want to attack me because I'm saying the truth. You are enemy of freedom. Your life will never be good. You know what I'm saying? Your life will never be good. When you go to church, you see pastors. They will say, God, set them on fire. Set them on fire. They will say, Jesus. Some church will say, die. 
Dab a fire, dab a fire. It does not mean they are arrogant. Because that is the gospel. You can never pray for your enemy to prosper more than you. Your enemy will go down before you. No matter whatever they use against you, they're going to go down before you. Trust me. I have freedom. My children have freedom. My children will never need a visa. Never in their life. It's done. I don't, I don't need a visa in my life. You know what I mean? A country that I need a visa to, I don't have to go. You know what I mean? So, do not think what I'm doing here. If you think I'm doing it for myself, why am I spending 99.9 .9 amount of money that I spend on people freedom movement is my money? Nobody. Thanks to brothers and sisters who have wake up, who understand that I cannot do it alone. I cannot. That is the fact. So, let me tell you something. I have, there's no better leader to start a movement than me because I have zero crime. I've never been in jail. I've never committed anything. Zero, 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 nada, nada. You know what I'm saying? Rien. Zero. So, do you think if I have a skeleton in my cupboard by now, my enemy would have dig it out by now? You know what I'm saying? So whatever you see online, rubbish you see online, don't pay attention to it. Ignore it. Very soon they're going to tell you, oh, I'm sleeping with that. I'm sleeping with this. I'm sleeping with... It's going to come. I don't care. Everybody like woman. If they tell me that we embrace it, I am not a man that we run away from woman. No way. I love women. So whatever they want to say, I'm ready for it. I prepare myself mentally for this job that I'm doing. A job with no pay. So that is it. <laughs> Uh, what I'm going to go to next right now uh, is EFCC. You know what I mean? EFCC. There's this small girl that I don't know what to... I'm going to talk about it. She, I will not mention her name. She's a witch. This girl. I, everybody is talking about her. She's a Lucifer. Ogbanje water. Ogbanje mommy water. God destroy you in Jesus' name. This place is not for you. That is number one. This small girl, go to her Facebook. Go and tell her she's a witch. I believe she have nobody. She have destroyed all her family. You know what I'm saying? Whether her name is... Uh, 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 it starts with E, I don't know. So, uh, that girl, she's Mami Water Spirit. That is what they call it. Ogmanje. May God Almighty set your head on fire. In Jesus' mighty name. That is number one. EFCC. I am going to call on EFCC director... But next week, so I'm going to call on them. I'm going to give, give them an offer. My offer is that we're going to work with them, the PFM, People Freedom Movement. We're going to set up Citizen Investigation Department. I repeat, Citizen Investigation Department. So we're going to set it up. Whenever EFCC, we have any information, we're going to notify them. Every Nigerian citizen, we're going to notify them and we're going to have our own lawyer. Whenever EFCC make any arrest and EFCC, they find any money or recover any money. You know what I'm saying? Whatever any amount of money they recover, we're going to have our lawyer to prosecute that individual. We are not going to wait for government to do it. You know what I'm saying? We will not wait for government to do it because Nigerian government, they are incapable of protecting themselves not to talk of our money. Since good luck, Jonathan, since the era of uh, Obasanjo, the money, amount of money EFCC have recovered, no one have given account of it. Anybody tell me if I'm lying. They keep saying, Ranomigo, come online. Whatever he said is not true. Blah, 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 blah. Enough of that. You know what I'm saying? No one, not even Obasanjo, not even good luck, Jonathan, who is a professor. You see that professor? Professor. Good Lord Jonathan was in the military. He never served in the Nigerian army. He was a professor. Okay. Obasi your money. No one found where it is. Good Lord Jonathan. No one found it. Buari. No one found it. So far they have failed us. All of them. So we citizen, We have every right. To connive or work with the law enforcement department. Mostly and especially the AFCC. We're going to monitor them. We're going to take our own lawyer. I'm going to call on them. Those that have your number, bring it to me. I'm going to make sure. We're going to tell them. We're going to pay for our own lawyer. I will work hard. I will work to donate and pay for the lawyers. We're going to have people freedom movement lawyers. Citizen lawyers. 
Whenever government prosecute them, our lawyer will go there. You know what I mean? They will be aware. And this lawyer is not permanent. When you fight on a case, two or three cases, and that leader is not in jail, how can an robber, a man that steal, not even an robber, a thief, thief, who stole 1,000 naira, will go for 10 years imprisonment. And a leader, a leader who stole 10 billion, 20 billion, will be contesting for a governor election, or he will be contesting for a senator, will be contesting for... Can you imagine Nigeria? Can you... What is going on? What the hell is going on in Africa? You know what I'm saying? What is wrong with our leaders? That is the problem. What is wrong with our leaders? You can try to say, oh, an amigo is this. Oh, anybody want to talk about this? This 419 EFCC, fake EFCC, like my own brother call it. Fake EFCC. You know? So, then, the EFCC, whenever they recover money, they take what they want in it. I, that is what people told me. They will take it, they will negotiate, they will arrest, they will call them to question it. Every day is question it, question it, question it, question it, question it. Their question it never ends. EFCC. Why? Why? I mean, police officer, high rank officer is here watching me. It's right here watching me. You know what I'm saying? Why? Why are you doing that? Why? Please, I'm asking you, why? Why? What is the meaning of EFCC? Since the creation of EFCC, Nigeria corruption has exploded. Nigeria become number one, the most corrupt country in the whole world. Why? APC, PDP, they are the same. They are criminals. The good ones, the good ones who want to contest for a good, just, or for his own good thing, they will never allow him. They will tell him, oh, they will use primary to knock you out. That one is not going to happen in a dose state this time. I will make sure I work with the administration. If they are ready to work to help a dose state, I will work with them and make sure this time there will be no internal primary no way no way it's not going to happen and if they dare do it that means they have called another battle to edo state edo state should be an example of leadership in nigeria now because when the heart stop working the whole country stop and when the heart stop beating the whole country stop and edo state happen to be the heartbeat of nigeria is that true or false can somebody tell me correct so that is the truth. So I want our brothers who are in law enforcement agency, please, 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 if you are in the EFCC, I want you to deviate from your barbaric way of stealing. You have never prosecuted successfully. Pro Can anybody give me one name? The EFCC have jail in Nigeria since the creation of EFCC. Who is allocating money for EFCC? Why are they tying gear? I have my gear here. They tell their gear police, blah, 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 like you are almighty God. You ain't nobody. You, you can't even pass a security test in the United States. That is the fact. You cannot even pass it. You ain't nobody. You are zero. All you do is because we respect you. Once you put on your uniform, we respect that uniform. You know what I'm saying? Don't use your uniform to oppress anyone. Please, EFCC, we're going to work with you. We're going to make sure all this leader. Whenever they leave Nigeria, contact contact PFN, People's Freedom Movement. Contact us. I will make sure we have agents all over the world. We're going to set up our own investigation department. If you are a retired police officer, a retired military officer, home and abroad, you want to join us, contact me. We're going to set up a PFN, People's Freedom Movement Investigation Unit. We will investigate you. We will track you. We will expose you. We will shame you. We will, we will blow out every trumpet. You know me. I am a mega comrade. I can talk. I talk the good talk. And I walk the walk. I will dismantle you. You know what? I will finish you with my mouth. God has empowered me. Whenever you are caught, you will never run in any political party. Let me tell you. Before you destroy yourself, let me. the only way you can silence me, the only way is to do the right thing. You cannot. I am ready if you threaten me. It will be better for you to just allow me to do my work. If you threaten me, I will stay in the United States forever. 
I continue to hit you. I hit you, hit you, hit you, hit you until you are brought behind bar. Another government will come in. They will give me humility, what they call humility. When they give me humility, I will go to Nigeria. You are free of any charge. You know what I mean? They will sign it. I will give it to my lawyer. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not stupid. So if you don't want me to hit you, it's better you join us. Let's eradicate corruption. That is number one. Nobody is going to stop this movement. No, nobody, not even my mother and my father. They cannot stop it. Nobody. Nobody. Only Jesus Christ. And I know God gave his children freedom. So God cannot be against us. The only thing, I am a preacher. I am a freedom preacher. That is what I am. You know what I mean? So, there. Okay. So, that is it. I want every brothers and sister to understand that Nigeria is going to wake up. Africa is going to wake up. That useless Addis Ababa, they created whatever they call it, Addis Ababa. That useless place, AU, that they are taking our youngest to go and use and dump anyhow. You know what I mean? That Addis Ababa, I'm coming to them. Gradually, I want to do it the way I do it. I am doing it. I believe in honesty. When you're doing things and you know what you are doing, do it the way God asks you to do it. Don't let anybody distract you. Follow your route. Do it. Please. I call for advice. My advice that I call for, advise me how we can grow the movement financially, physically. Those two things. Don't come and call me and advise me how I will come and talk about uh, Oyegu. Oh, I will come here and talk about uh, uh, Moses. How oh, I will come here and talk about Abraham. No. If you want to talk about Abraham, you talk about Abraham on your TV show. You know what I'm saying? Talk about Abraham on your TV show. Don't come here and tell me, oh, this is how you speak English. I don't give a... F oh, shit. Excuse me. I do not give a damn. I do not give a God. And whatever you think about, I don't care. To hell with you, with your opinion. That is it. If you think what I'm doing is not good for you, you don't have to. Join the, join the Rebbe. You know what I'm saying? Join the Rebbe. I think President Mohamed Buhari is on our side. If you want to fight corruption, I will ask him, what I want to ask you, Mr. President, Your Excellency, with your due respect, you know I have, I, I love you. I've been through what you've been through a lot. I was, I have sick. I know what sickness is. I'm not going to give you a headache. I just want you to tell us. Before you, before next year, I want you to give us the list of Nigerian leaders who you have caught with corruption. How many of them in prison? I want this video to reach President Mohamed Dubabangida. I mean, Mohamed Dubawari. Babangida is still in my, in my mouth because that man single handedly built Abuja. God bless him. Even though he do all that thing that is not good, I still like him. Okay, Mohamed Dubawari, President Mohamed Dubawari, I want you to tell Nigerians. All these political leaders that you have caught stealing, how many of them are you kri kri? I hear kri kri in your mouth when you were contesting. That is why I supported you. How many political governors who are criminals are in kri kri or in Oko prison in Menedo State? How many? How many have you successfully charged and prosecuted and how I want to know. I want to know. Don't tell us. Don't bamboozle us. We are all not stupid. You know what I'm saying? We are not stupid at all. Don't tell us it's white. Look, look at these two shit. Eh? This, this is black. If we come on, no. This is black. This is white. Can anybody not know the difference? Eh? Why will you arrest a, a simple man? A man who name is dog. Buhari. A dog. Come on, dog. They arrested him. They put him in jail. Okay, me that is talking. They said, don't come to Nigeria. Uh, we already settled that issue. That issue is pending. I pause it. What I call pause. You know what it's called? Pause. Pause. When it does not go well, then you hit, activate. It bam. Explosion will start. Peaceful explosion. You know what I'm saying? So, that is that one. How many you have jail? Don't tell us you are fighting corruption. You are not, sir. With your due respect. You are not fighting corruption. That is the fact. If you are really fighting corruption, where are the list of criminals? We have never heard of any Nigerian previous governor who is serving 20 years in jail. 
who is having 30 years in jail, who is in the last sentence. Congressman Jefferson of Louisiana is in jail in America, who was connected to all this uh, money laundry in Nigeria. He's serving a jail. He's right here. My friend, one of my co-officers, he's seeing him every day. He's right here. He's not about 30 miles from my, where I live. Single V, federal prison, right here in Single V, Texas. That is where he is. I know where he is. You know what I'm saying? I have court officers who are working in Federal Bureau of Prison. You know what I'm saying? We went to academy together. These are Americans. I know that they tell me a lot of senators who are in jail there, state senators who are in jail, single V jail, federal prison. So how many in Nigeria? How many? That is the fact. So enough of all this propaganda of APC, corruption, 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 corruption. You are not fighting nothing. Continue to eat as many as you want to eat. But one day, our God Almighty will strike all the bad leaders. The same way our children have died in South Africa. The same way Nigerians are jumping from upstairs in Dubai and kill themselves because police are coming. Their family cannot feed. They don't want to go back home. They would rather choose to jump from five-story building, four-story building, and kill themselves than to go to Nigeria. That is how bad Nigeria have come. May her soul rest in perfect peace. Nobody knows where she is. Where she's from? Because Nigeria is a dead country. Number one, it's dead. All these leaders, APC, PDP, they cannot revive it. The only way we're going to do it is we that is in diaspora. Look at Gambia. I keep saying it every day. Before you call my goddamn phone or before you do anything, my, my brothers and sisters, go and watch my video. Watch it. Don't call on me and be questioning me. How can I explain to thousands and thousands of people? Take your time. Be patient. Go through my videos. Watch them. Then you can come and tell me. Ask me. You know what I'm saying? You know? That is it. Don't be calling me and be questioning me. Question Mohamed Buhari. Question your state governor. Question your state senator. Instead of you coming here and be calling me, questioning me, why can't you call your state senator? That is the problem. Let us be honest to ourselves. You know what I'm saying? That is the that is the fact, you know. The truth, it, truth ain't going nowhere. It's gonna be here. The truth is gonna stay with me. You know what I'm saying? So, let me tell you, enough of that corruption. They gotta do something better. Nigerian law enforcement agency, they are not fighting corruption. That is the fact. I want everyone and every brothers registration to vote. PVC is out. I want everyone to go ahead and register. If you have not registered, go ahead and do it. Now, Edo State, this is personal information, but I'm going to give it out. Edo State is going to hold a uh, local government election. They're going to do it. That's good. That's good. If uh, the governor of Edo State does that, we praise him. Let's hold an election. Do not involve in it. Mind your own business. Don't involve in it. All those Edo State political leaders, let me tell you, at those state elections, there will be no gun. And there will be no sharing of money. No, it's not going to happen. Because any local government, they share money to buy votes. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. It's going to, the governor will have responsible for it. That is the fact. So he should provide adequate, adequate rule. The way it's done in the United States. He knows it. He should do it that way. Let a those state be in peace. Let it do what he's doing. We will join hand together and help him. Whatever he want to do, would me myself, any day that I see he's doing a fantastic job. I say, I will come here. People will be surprised. I keep saying it every day. I will praise him. You know what I'm saying? I will praise him. All those little, little houses in the those state, there is no skyscraper. Enough of that. But our father who are at home, they don't want to talk about it. All they just care about is let me just leave. They have suffered enough. I understand. You know what I mean? So they don't want to talk about it. So that is for Edo State. The election primary is going to be around September or August or, or September. So whenever they set up the official date, I will let them know. So please, I want everyone to go home and register. If you want to run in any political party, I want you to call on us. We are not PDP. We are not APC. I have helped APC. I have obtained an APC card. You know what I'm saying? APC card, membership card. But people were calling me PDP, PDP. No, that is not true. I have PDP. I am an independent minded. 
if we cannot be fast enough to register our party before the election, we're going to choose any political party we're going to use. That is the fact. Because we cannot allow this time to pass by us and wait for another four years. No, we are not going to do that. So, we're going to try. It's easy to talk the talk. You don't do that. You don't go there. No. All these things need money. It need money. Don't talk about money. We're going to talk about money. It's money. If we're going to elect anyone in the office, we're going to make a donation. We're going to help individuals. Do not come and join People's Freedom Movement because you need money. We're going to check your page, Facebook page. Facebook does not lie. And see when you continue to share our movement. When you have been a member, you cannot change it. So that is the criteria. We don't need you to have money. No. How you are be helping us fighting corruption, fighting against xenophobia, against police brutality. So I'm going to talk about police. I'm coming. So that is number one. So I want everyone to understand, it is time for us to take our world into action. You know what I'm saying? This movement is not going anywhere. So that is why whatever I'm going to do from now on, I'm going to make sure the boss talk, stop with me. Everything I'm doing because I have built a, a big mansion, what do they call it, glass house. I'm not going to allow any stone to come and destroy it. If you want to buy a stock in the glass house, you invest in it. Come and buy a stock. When you put in your money, it's like a stock market. You will never let it crash. You will never throw a stone at this glass house. No. But when you did not do anything, that is where you don't care. You know what I'm saying? So, that is where you don't care. You throw anything at it. You don't care. You have nothing to lose. That is a fact. So, I want you to understand that. The more you commit, you, you create problem for yourself the more it becomes difficult for you. Because I'm going to watch you for the rest of my life. There will be no political office for you. I will come out and speak against you. That is the fact. If you have anything negative about me, come out and speak against me. You are free. It's, it's freedom for everyone. That is why I'm happy. I have never, never, never let my guard down. You know what I'm saying? I treat every brothers and sister as equal. We are all equal. We don't need any oppression. No, not in our group. There's nobody that is going to come there and be insulting you. If we are not, if they do what we want them to do and we are together, we are all fighting the same cause. You know what I'm saying? That is not, that is the truth. So I want everyone to know that. And those who have stopped working for a while now, I notice you. So if you come back tomorrow and start saying, oh, my mega comrade, my mega comrade, your name is going to be checked. So that is it. I am going to, about to stop right now. There is a police video that is going on. I'm going to talk about it on Monday. So I want every brothers and sister to understand. If you need anything, just go ahead. If you want to order for the shirt, I told you again, it's $25 right now. $25. So you can go ahead and order for it. So you send your money. As soon as you send your money, then I'll go ahead and mail it to you. Nobody else have it. Nobody. Nobody can do it. So nobody. Nobody have the right to do it. That, that is the truth. So I'll go ahead and mail it to you. So I love you all. You're going to see me on Monday. Uh, hey, buddy, let me quickly address this. I'm not supposed to talk about it. If you are a People's Freedom Movement member and you want to be a member, don't come with a portfolio. No. There's no portfolio in our movement. So, if I tell you, be a from, work in a Facebook and you do not want to work in Facebook, you want to work in where I am not assigning you to. I am a leader of this group. I single-handedly create this group. I single-handedly still spending my money on it. I don't expect you to come and be telling me what I should do, what I should not do. If you think you're smarter than me, you should have done it a long time ago. If you think you are still smarter than me, instead of you calling around, those people you are calling now, they are still calling me. You even call them this morning, tell them, oh, it's not true. You should be ashamed of yourself. I don't want to hit you. Because if I hit you, you will not, you will not even have a place to go. You know what I'm saying? So... I want you to respect yourself. Mind your business. You cannot destroy this movement. No way. You are too little. You are just like a dog. Not even, no, a rat. You are not even up to a chicken. A rat. You are too little. So I want you to mind your business. If anyone want to do an audio, I don't need an advice from you. What I need from you, tell us how you going to contribute. How you going to move this movement forward. Just tell us. Don't tell me, oh, you need to accept this. You need to accept that. No, I do this on my own. I am me. I'm the one that put my life on the line. You can buy a ticket now. I cannot go to Nigeria. I can't. Until they give me what I want. 
Then I can go. They pay me my money. They give me humil uh, humility. Then I can go. But you can go anywhere freely. So you should understand that. I put everything on it. This is my life. My blood, everything is on it. So don't come here and be telling me how to run my house. I have a peaceful house. My home is good. So run your house. Let me run my This is my house. I'm fighting for freedom. Freedom is my house. If you want to join us, come and join us. If I catch you, you make an audio. You did not verify or you did not know anything. And you are saying you are making an audio. Damage is easy to do. I will remove you from the group. That is the fact. Many are choose. But, I mean, many are called. Few are choosing. I don't know what is say in the Bible. You can see Moses did not get to the promised land. Everything he did. Because he made a mistake. You know what I'm saying? When God told him, strike that sword one time. The water was not enough. He did it for the second time. That is not what God told him. But if I give you one chance, two times, three times, four times chance, you keep doing it over, you have your own ego. You have your own ego. You have a problem. How can you work with me when you are not man enough to call me and say, Sir, I am sorry for what I did. Sir, I will never do it again. Sir, I, please forgive me, sir. Sir, I want to help you. If you cannot call me and you are calling around, how do you think you can work with me? The trust is gone. It's gone. So what is left for you now is to do what is right for you. This movement, if you want to be a part of it, you are free. So, you are 100% free. But we're going to watch you. You're going to be like any other person, but you're going to watch. You gave me a rule. There's a rule you gave me. You told me anyone that violated the rule of WhatsApp, they should be on probation for three months. I have the message you sent to me. I ask you, if you violate the rule, will you do the same? You say yes. But if I want to use that rule that you created for yourself, for others, you created it for precious. Uh, that is why you created it. I said the name because precious is a very honest woman. Everybody knows that. Only that no one is perfect. I'm hot temper. Everybody is hot temper. She's saying the truth. So I want everyone to know if any of PFM member come to you and say rubbish, they are fired because I the misconduct. I do not tolerate nonsense. I am a leader that Nigeria wants. If I hire you and you are in any cabinet, and I tell you there's no bribing and oppression, and you continue to do it, I will dismantle the your executive. I will not wait for you to come and hit my nose before I will realize now he has come to me. No, you are gone. That's it. If Buhari can do that now, it, Nigeria would have been good. So I am proud of myself. I love what I'm doing. Uh, I'm sorry, my wife is calling me. Let me just tell her, I'm, hey, baby, I'll call you back. I'm on the line, okay? I'll call you back. Okay. So, then, you can see that. So, I want, no matter what you do, respect your woman. It don't matter. Pick up the phone. Let her know what you are doing. Respect your woman. You know what I'm saying? So, I know what I'm going through. So, I don't want to stay long. Please, if you see anyone that is out of people's freedom movement, they are out because they have their own selfish, whatever they, they have their plan. I will deactivate your plan. Look at my hand. I deactivate it. Blank, 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 blank. Like we're going to deactivate this corruption in Nigeria. If you want to be a part of it, come and join us. You are a rat. Mind your business. Stop calling people freedom movement anywhere. Create your own friend. These are the friends, my brothers and sisters, that I create. There's nothing you can do. You should be ashamed of yourself. I don't want to come to the public and criticize you. But I'll give you the last warning. I do not want to hear any pem, any pem. You know, mind your business, let me mind my business. If you want to join me, the money for the t-shirt that you all run away from, look at the t-shirt. You all go ahead and send the money. Send it first. Show it. Tell them the truth. Because you want, you want money for yourself, you don't want to pay for it. You just want to rape what you did not sow. May God forgive you your sin. If you think I'm lying, send, why have you to send me the money? Send it. Let's go and bring the 5,000 t-shirt. Go ahead and do it. Let's buy the machine 6,000 plus. Invest your money in it. Buy the stock. Tomorrow now you will run to, to print and say, oh, print this for me. You will go to jail. I will jail you. I'll make sure I'll kill your paper. Your document will be gone. Trust me. I'll make sure that document is revoked completely. Don't play with me. I am a tiger and a lion. Don't play with me. Don't mess with me. So that is number one. I love everyone. I'm going to get out of Facebook. I have addressed this issue. I'm not going to come back and speak about it again. If you want to join the movement, go ahead. I'm not, I don't have time for mocking the war bamboo the chop. I love everyone. Thank you so much. You can see it. I love you very soon. I promote you. If you have any children who want to join United States Air Force, look at it. They can join it. It's the best. 
is the best is the best of the best anyone that want to join united states military i want to promote you you can join it call on me you know what i mean my son just put someone in the air force uh, uh, la last week so my son can help you we show you how to do it you will join the air force or you if you want to join the navy that's fine yeah and that's it but air force is better is better so i love you all. so anything you are doing i want you to keep doing it i love everyone on monday same time we're going to be here so i'll let you know what we're going to talk about about the embassy we're going to do that on friday because i'm going to use one way to talk about about embassies and um, uh embassies and immigrations so in europe please those are in europe uh i want you to do whatever you can do contribute because if you want me to come to Europe, I have to fly down there. I'm not going to spend my, my son money. His salary is already in this movement. My own son. So as soon as he gets paid, I'm taking it to print more shit. So it's already in it. So I want you to know if I can take all my family money and put in it, who, who are you to come and just come and say you want? May God forgive you. That's all I can say. Oba, I talk with you. He said, so uh, those people, everybody is happy now. Uh, there's peace in the, in the, you know. Anywhere lion attack a fight. Hey, hey, hey. That place is not easy. I love you people. God bless everyone. JJ, I love you all. Bye-bye.